What's going on guys, Maniacs here, and welcome to Pass 12. Now, this game actually popped up the other day, and this is a student-led project by DigiPen, I believe. I think that might be an actual facility that the students built it at. Anyway, this game looks really, really cool. I found this article on Alpha Beta Gamer, and this is a 2D hor survival horror style game, where you play as a young kid who's trapped in like this apartment complex, and you're trying to, I think, escape. I have no idea really specifically. I don't want to really know a lot about it because the develop the actual article said the game is about 15 minutes, but it does a really good job at explaining the story, giving you a good little game, and then that moves and then you move on from it. So I don't really know too much about it, but apparently the world around you can change at just any instant. And I there's something that this boy is homing with. It's like photo photo something i can't remember what it is anyway let's play the game and see what it has to offer i've had this on my computer for the past couple of days but i have not been able to play it and i apologize for the recent release of videos and stuff like i said last week i got a new job so it's really hard <laughs> compared to my old one so i've been really tired during the week and obviously i can record nico 9 and stuff during the week but this game i wanted to play for today looks really cool let's check it out and see what it has to offer and the visuals and everything looked really, really cool. It's supposed to be really creepy. Uh, I have no, I have not seen this game on like, I have not seen this game on Game Jolt or itch.io. The Storm. It looks very beautiful. Am I supposed to do something? Okay, the game's going to do it automatically. I don't want to skip anything. Ugh, can't sleep. I should take a walk. In the middle of the night, in a pouring rain okay sure all right how do i move okay so it's just a oh my god this kid's eyes look at them this kid has seen some shit okay you you have a really weird jump graphics and everything look kind of cool okay i should turn i should i should off the lamp to save electricity the storm has been going since morning okay that was weird so you can turn the lights on and off Oh, so you turn the lights on and off to find different things. Where did mom put her keys? I'm assuming there's these right here. Got the keys. Okay, so you hold left to shift. Or you hold shift to shift left to shift. Shift to run. Um, A and D to rotate. Turn the knob. Nope, that didn't work. Oh, that worked. Okay. The wind is so strong. Shift to toggle the to run. This game has puzzles and stuff in it too. The lift's not working. I should find another way down. So I hopefully I'll be able to get through it. You guys know that I'm awful at puzzle games, so hopefully I can get through this. Yeah, what parent? I used to play hide and seek when he when he was around. When who was around? What parent lets their kid go wandering in the middle of the night when it's fucking pouring out in their apartment complex? W to enter lift. What if I go over here? Oh, it has a city landscape in the back too. Is this a door? No, it's not. He told me to never go up there. Who told you? Okay. This is really cool so far. I like the art style and everything. Like I said, this game is built. Uh, this game was a student project, so I don't know how many students specifically worked on it, but I'm pretty impressed. With what? Okay, there's a creepy dude over there. I'm just gonna go this way. Thank you. All right, no, I could go in there, but I actually kind of want to go see the creepy dude. Oh. Hi, dude. Wow, that's strange. Who reads newspaper at this hour? Really? That's all I have to say? You're not going to say anything else about the creepy old man who's just sitting here reading a newspaper in the middle of the night? No? Okay, that's fine. I hear an alarm. Oh, it's this. I hope no one is trapped inside. Hi, kitty cat. Here, kitty. Hi, kitty cat. You cute little one. Okay. Alright, bye, kitty. Why is there just a random car sitting there? Okay. Boy, that elevator's fucked up. Nobody... Okay, bye, newspaper. Nobody gives a shit about the fact that that elevator is... Huh? What's happening? Okay. This is fucking... Uh... I don't like this one bit. It's creeping me out. Yeah, no shit. Everything is back to normal. Oh. So when the lights go out, maybe next time? Can I go in here? No? Okay. Can I turn the lights off again? No? I should go home. Alright, I guess I'll go home. I'm gonna go in the lift. So when the lights go out, that's when everything changes. Okay. 
I don't know about you, but if I saw... Was I imagining this? If I saw that freaking elevator freaking out and stuff, I would probably not take the lift. I would probably end up going, just walking. Just walking up and down the stairs. Okay. Why does 12-3 have a weird door? Why does it have a red door? There's the elevator that's broken. Here's my apartment. Blocked. I need to find another way. Yeah, okay. Uh, why would your door be covered in fucking boards and shit? And, yeah, that's fine. Wow, everything's boarded up. Oh. Uh, what? Oh, my God. Okay. All right. Uh, we're gonna, we're gonna... All right. I'm trapped. Okay, so not only do I have a monster, I've got a fucking creepy dude with a lantern. Excellent. That thing is horrifying. Fuck off, monster. Go away. It's really intense. If I go back, my house is still blocked. Okay, that's better. What the f- Okay. Alright. The building is coming apart. I must move before it comes back. Oh. Oh, shit. Okay, that was really weird. Oh, come on. I can go- I can get out through this window. Is there anything over here? No, there's not. Okay. Yeah, I'd be pretty fucking creeped out right now. Pretty, pretty creeped out. That's what you get for going to walk, walk in the middle of the night. Great, my socks are wet. That's what you're complaining about. You just saw a fucking floating shadow monster. That's a strange looking vase. Yeah, it's probably a creature. Oh, this whole room is full of water. Why can't I go over there? Okay. There's no place to hide. I think it can hear me. Oh... Uh Oh, that's not good. Oh. Okay. That's creepy as fuck. I don't know. Does this thing have to completely form in order to... I do like the way that it... It slowly ekes out. Alright, if I turn that light on, will it go away? That's fucking creepy. I kind of wish I could turn my character to look at me. Go away, vase. Fuck off. I don't know what this thing has to form. Is there a head that comes out too, or is it just his arms, then bam. Why can't I turn the fucking lights on? Also, I can't sprint. And I don't know if this thing will just get me if it forms itself. Alright. It's too risky to unlock this door now. Oh. I should turn off the tap first. That should do it. Oh, okay. So if I turn the light on. Ah, alright. So there's one little lantern over here. Oh, okay. So I wonder. Ah, see, and now it's gone. It only appears in the darkness. Okay, gotcha. Alright. So I can. Uh, I don't get how this is supposed to work. Is it. No? No. Oh, okay, so I guess the whole bar just has to be filled. Alright, that's not too bad. I can't see anything. No, you're right. Okay, that's alright. It looked like there was something there. I can escape to that vent. This kid is pretty goddamn smart. Ugh, I don't like the ickiness that that has. There seems to be a path across. Oh, I have to wait for the lightning. There we go. I see it. I should sprint over to the vent. Uh, don't fall. Oh, okay. Uh. Did the game just fucking restart? Okay, thank God. That would have been annoying. So I have to spam E. Uh, get in the vent. Okay, I, I, I pressed the button. I pressed the button. But I don't think you... I think this is the type of game where you can't actually be pressing any other button except the button you need to press. At the time. I'm gonna wait here. There we go. Got through. I see it. I should sprint over to the vent. Oh, okay. So it's the same thing. 
I really like the way that the game does it with the light and stuff like that. Like, you can only- that looks kind of creepy. You can only see stuff when you're in the light. That is creepy looking. This game has very subtle little things that it does. Oh, I'm in the- Oh, I'm just going up. Weren't we told never to go up? Then again, everything is dark now. Is there another- Is there another vent over here, or- No? Oh, I- I should grab the light bulb first. Okay. It's time to end this. End what? Is that your mom? What are we doing? Where are we? What the f What is going on? I came back to my room. Or I came back to the apartment. Alright, I have a light bulb now. I broke into my mom's room through her vent. She totally didn't wake up at all because I'm sure this kid can totally move the vent and everything. No problem. Am I just supposed to go upstairs now? What? Where's the ladder gone? No way out. Okay. That's creepy as fuck. It's back! Oh, uh, oh, uh, it saw nothing. Go away, monster. Go away, shadow demon. The game pulses when it does that. It's kind of eerie. Is it actually going to go away now, or am I just going to have to wait for it to go to the right and then go back? Fuck off, monster. God, he looks so eerie in that fucking thing. He's like, I will eat your soul. Are you going to go away, or am I just going to have to book it left when you go to the right? I might just have to book it left when you go to the right, but I don't know yet. I'll give it another minute. Seems like he's not really moving. Yeah, you're really not. Alright, so I am just going to have to run left when he goes all the way to the right, because he goes pretty much off screen at some point. Okay, you're not going to now. You're just going to be kind of cheap and just kind of go very slowly. Oh, you're coming back. All right. Are you going to go away at some point? It'd be really nice if you could. Or if you could go to the right a little bit more so that I could go left, seeing how I can't literally go anywhere else. There's nothing to my right. I have to go left. It would have been nice if there was a note that came up saying I should probably run while it's distracted. Alright, fuck it. We're gonna run. We're gonna run. I've gotta find another way out. Fast. Boy, that thing is not very fast, but... Okay, well, we're fucked. No way out. Elevator? Oh! Okay. Just had a never-ending run now, huh? Nope. Okay. Oh, shit. Not good. Come on, come on, come on, come on. I love how this is the only thing I can hide in the creature so doesn't know I'm here. I need you to fuck off to the right a little bit more, dude. I can't get out while you're standing right there. Is this the type of situation where I'm just going to keep repeating, going left? Oh god! Okay, well... The buttons don't continuously work. You have to keep press the buttons whenever it's a new thing, so... Fuck off. None of those lifts work. This one is the... That one doesn't work either. Okay, now the creature's just gone. This one works. Ha ha. So I guess I just had to keep find looking for the right one. So it was a type of situation. I did have to go to the right. Wait, where am I? Oh, there I am. Okay. Alright, there's nothing over there. The storm's getting stronger. Okay, the monster's coming. Just keep running, kid. What is that? Oh, there's a... There's a light bulb up there. 
Is he? Is that the dead guy? Oh no, it's getting in. Uh. Okay. Uh, thanks, old man. I guess. Wait. Dad? What has it done to you? What? Okay. There we go. And then the sun comes up. So why is there a container just sitting on top? And why was his father trapped in there? That doesn't make any sense. The creature is gone at last. The date. Wasn't it the 12th? Alright, so that was past 12. That was really good. It was really short. It was really fun, too. Sorry I sat in that spot for way too long. I guess there, maybe it could have been nice if there was a little hint saying, maybe I should run while it goes by. I don't know. That was really cool. Now, I have no way of actually putting this video on, like, their site or anything like that for them to watch. So, if they happen to come across it, developers, nice job. This was a really cool little game. Really, really short. I liked the animation. The music was really well. Everything worked. And it was creepy, like that monster was coming after you. I still kind of don't understand the whole thing with his father being trapped in that container. Why did that happen? How did he get trapped in there? Those things only lock from the outside. So the only thing that I can think of is maybe he went in there and somebody closed in on him and killed him. I have no idea. That was a cool short little game. If you guys want to check this game out for yourself, I'll put a link to it in the description below. You can download it for free. If there's anything that I happen to miss, please let me know in the comment section below. And let me know what you guys' thoughts. What are your theories on the fact that his father, I, I guess maybe the creature... Is, is that the representation of this person who killed his father or something like that? I don't really know. But it's... I don't know. It's it's weird to think. I just don't know what the... How the correlation of his father being dead in the container all that time and nobody finding him. That's just weird. But anyway, that's all the time I got for today, guys. Thank you all for checking out the video. And I'll see you guys next time. Maniacs, out.